Hello everyone and welcome to Project Pitaya. This video is more so in blog format so you don't have to necessarily look at your screen. In the next few minutes I'll briefly be talking about soil for your dragon fruit cactus. So over time I've had the opportunity to speak with different dragon fruit growers both commercial and hobbyists like myself and the general idea is the same. You want to have loose, rich, aerated soil with good drainage and high organic matter. I've also made videos on this topic before and we'll go ahead and link them down in the description below. But today though, I want to, for those of you who may not know or may have not seen yet, the University of California's cooperative extension has recently put out videos on dragon fruit cultivation. They really have put some great information on some videos for everyone's benefit. The videos are hosted by Ramiro Lobo who is the small farms advisor and is very well versed on dragon fruit. So for those of you who haven't actually had the chance to meet Ramiro Lobo I find him to be a good person, he seems to really enjoy what he does, and he's a very approachable person. He and the staff at UCCE San Diego continue to study, evaluate, investigate, and collect different varieties of dragon fruit, along with other fruit species as well. So we're lucky to have him nearby. For those of you who live in Southern California, you might also consider attending this year's Dragon Fruit Festival. Fingers crossed everybody and hopefully the event takes place again this year. Okay, getting back to the point at hand. Ramiro and the staff at UCCE were kind enough to make a specific video on planting your dragon fruit cactus and the type of soil medium slash mixture they use. With that said, I'll put a link in the description below and while you're there check out a few other videos on dragon fruit cultivation as well. In short, excellent information from Ramiro and the dedicated staff who work diligently in providing information for commercial dragon fruit growers or for us the dragon fruit hobbyists. Thanks for listening everybody and happy dragon adventures.